Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Masters with me. So this time round, we're gonna check out Caitlyn's story adventure, and of course, we're gonna see how impressive she is as a trainer. So we get to test her out during her story event. So let's go dive in and see what she can do to impress us with. Central City was a buzz with trainers and Pokemon. Oh. As usual, didn't have to wait long to be challenged to a battle. This time her opponents looked particularly strong. <laughs> Come on team, these guys are nothing to panic over. This battle is gonna be ours. Oh, I lose to you. Alright. In the end, we won, but she was surprised to find Caitlyn watching the battle from nearby. Nee. Is she a stalker? <laughs> well, fancy running into you here. Lovely battle. I saw you fighting out of the corner of my eye as I was walking into town and then I found I couldn't take my eyes off you. Oh dear, that's kind of dangerous. Very stalkerish. <sighs> I do have to point out one thing though. You could stand to win your battles with a touch more elegance. If I had any say in the matter. Oh dear, I guess I guess Hilda has really um, roughed me up with <laughs> being a bit more violent with my battles. I don't know, that's how she she did teach us with a perfect <laughs> in the last story. A trainer must always remain calm and collected. He must present an image of dignity, refinement and grace. That, my dear, is elegance. Once you find peace and gain a bit of emotional leeway, you begin to see things you couldn't before. <laughs> if you wish to fully utilize your skills in battle, elegance is of the utmost importance. Nah. Hey, you two aren't talking about fashion without me, are you? I heard something about grace and elegance? Well, what's the gossip? I want to know all the juicy details. <sighs> I think you may have misheard us. I wasn't talking about fashion. <laughs> I was just teaching my dear friend here that elegance is of the utmost importance when it comes to Pokemon battling. <sighs> Gee, do you really think so? I guess I've never thought about elegance like that before. Now I'm curious. <laughs> Very well. Perhaps I can show you both how grace and elegance can elevate one's prowess in battle. Oh, perfect! I watched super closely. Pokemon battling is all about focus. Nice! Alright, so let's do our first battle with them. If only I could switch out my trainer, you know, in case you guys don't actually power up your own personal trainer. Um, but yeah. No, no, no! I shouldn't have used that! That was going to help boost up my uh, energy gate. Oh god, that's the way. Okay, so we're gonna spike it. See how much damage it does. 301! Okay. Uh, no. Once again, using my trainers the wrong way. These guys don't follow my bad example <laughs> Alright. Since it's a low level talent, I think we did okay. Could have been cleared faster. But you know me, club is me. That's what Pokemon Masters is all about. Um, as what the producers' letters have been mentioning. They want us to get to know our trainers well enough so that we can make use of or rather use them in the most efficient way possible and that's what Pokemon Masters is all about. So yeah, let's dive into the second part of the story. Well done both of you. That battle was quite splendid. I just focused as hard as I could as always. That's what I'm best at. I don't think I would choose the word elegant to describe you in that battle. 
but you certainly had an air of strength and toughness about you. I could feel your energy across the battlefield. Oh wow, yeah! You're probably feeling that Candice focus that I'm known for? Pokemon fashion, romance, it's all about focus! My Obama Snow's focus is always top notch too! <laughs> it's a style that suits you and your Pokemon very well, I think. I used to be unable to control my own emotions or psychic powers I possess. Are you like Sabrina? <laughs> Whenever I lost a battle, they would spin entirely out of control. So much so that I was once forbidden from battling at all. All of that changed when I began interacting with psychic type Pokemon. They are able to manipulate their power at will, you see. <laughs> with their help, I learned to keep my negative emotions at bay. I learned how to remain calm, elegant, and at peace in any battle. Excellent, eh? I take great pride in my elegance, but I must admit that your focus has piqued my interest quite a bit, Candice. Well, gee, I still love to learn more about elegance too. Sounds like we should do a lot more battling together. Uh oh. Are we gonna fight both of them? Who's the third trainer among their team? Hmm. Alright, here we go. Elegance versus focus. Pokemon Ninja, stop! Alright, so psychic is that. I'm gonna use you to do ice punch. Alright, so let's use the boost. Boost our speed. Alright, hidden power. Okay, we're done with you. Psychic to the Grimer. There we go. Okay, let's see whether we'll see the, who the third trainer will be in her team. Well, Silence here. Would you say that was an elegant battle? I would definitely say it was much better than my first one. <laughs> what about me? Do you see how focused I was? Uh, I would say both. They were both elegant and focused. Naturally, I do my best to make every battle as graceful and refined as an elegant dance. Hey, just wanted to say your battle just now was super rad. Oh god, who is who is this super excited fella? Oh! Oh my god! I mean Roxy. <laughs> you guys know her as Roxy. I, I'm I'm more suited to knowing her in her Japanese name. What's all this about elegance and focus though? Did I miss something or Hey? Well you see. Ah I think I get it now. You want my honest opinion? After watching you guys battle? <laughs> I don't think elegance or focus are what's really most important when it comes to Pokemon battling. Mm. Well, what is then? With enough focus, you can pretty much do whatever you set your mind to. It's the best! I'm interested to hear what you have to say. Do go on. <laughs> well, in my opinion, it's gotta be the beat, the passion. Yes. You start riffing, you build up a killer rhythm, and then BAM! You smash your opponents in the face with it. <gasps> the beat? Not focus or elegance? Can beats be elegant? What, what is this part here? <laughs> it doesn't quite work well in English. <sighs> Passionate beats. Hmm. You've lost me, I'm afraid. <laughs> I guess it's kinda hard to put into words. Let's just skip it. Come on, I'll make you guys feel what I mean. I'll show you a Pokemon battle so wild it'll blow your mind. Uh, that's Omega for you. Oh, I'm gonna fight her? 
Okay, guess we have to beat our friends up to have them become our friends. Alright guys, let's do this. Let's fight you. Although we should have killed the Whipping Bell first. Okay. Okay, please decent damage. Uh -oh. So we're gonna do the psychic attack and we're gonna knock out. So I guess we're gonna have to oh. Okay, that was unexpected. I thought it wouldn't be enough. But yay! <laughs> Alright! So let's move on. Strength and kindness. Oh! Uh, what's going on, Roxy? You weren't supposed to lose. Uh, I guess I blew my chance at showing you guys what I was talking about. I wouldn't say that. It's true that we won the battle this time. But you certainly made an impression. Your attacks were like a raging rapid threatening to knock me down at any moment. Kevin's <laughs> right. It was seriously impressive. I felt like we were an inch from losing though the whole thing. True the whole thing, sorry. Uh. Really? What about the beat? Do you feel the beat? <laughs> As a matter of fact, I believe I did feel it. And after this last battle with you, I think I finally understand. When it comes to Pokemon battling, each and every trainer has their own belief about what is most important. Individual to them. And I think that's lovely. It's our differences that make us so interesting. I have to agree with her. I guess you've got a point. When I'm playing music, sometimes it's less about the beat and more about just chilling and enjoying myself. Yeah, I know not everybody is as super focused as I am, but more often than not, it's easy to tell when somebody really cares about their Pokemon and how much battling means to them. In other words, a trainer should never push others to follow their own personal methods, even if they believe they are correct. Anata. It didn't really come up in our conversation before, but after what I witnessed today, I would say that you seem to value kindness more than anything else when it comes to Pokemon battle. You shine with both kindness and strength in every battle you compete in. I saw that very clearly today. <laughs> I should thank you for helping me learn a valuable lesson today. I should be the one thanks to you. You're too kind, really. I feel as though you all have shown me an entirely new world. A whole new world. Okay, so <laughs> something like tells me I'm going to have very sweet dreams tonight thanks to you. I can't wait to see what I dream about. Okay, so that's really kind of strange and creepy if you get the entire story in, to in total. She she stalks us and then she says that she's gonna have a good dream tonight. I, I don't know. <laughs> well, that's just me doing selective thinking. So, alright, let's do this. Let's clear all these battles and let's unlock the co-op battle which is what we're here for. And let's see how tough Caitlyn is at her max power. Alright, so... Don't bore me, it's all about focus, and jumpstart, let's get Pikachu boosted. Alright, right, let's don't bore me again, jumpstart once more, focus, once we have enough gauge, let's do some offensive power, right, there we go. Yeah. 
psychic. Sorry. You know, you're weak against electric. So that. ああ、オッケー、レッツシュートキングフォーユー。ノーサイキ、ボルベノネ。行きなさい。えー、ダッシュビエ。私の壁が2個よ。決めろよ。よし、ゲラ。カモン。まだまだよ。オッケー。さあ
go with the pawn. Okay. There we go. Um, I guess all water, we don't really... I have not really done a lot of battling um, for the story and the EX battles, so that's probably one of the reasons why my equipments are still not there yet. Alright, so let's go with this team. Uh, we will adjust accordingly if I feel that there's a need to. So hopefully we've got some decent people joining us. So. Okay. Alright, so let's do our defense first. Because after that, followed by step boost offense. Alright, one more time. Hopefully, they are able to take her down. Alright, my Luna Tone can help out because I'm psychic type. Fantastic, usually I'll just switch out because it really doesn't do a lot of damage. Alright, so I can switch out and knock out. This one. It looks pretty okay, considering that this is a low level challenge. I really wonder what her very hard would be like. Or is it hard? Okay, I'm gonna stick with you. <laughs> Alright, so let's dive into the hardest difficulty and let's see how well we fare. Okay, I don't know. Should I keep Flint? Hmm. Well, I do have her though. Do I have all her stats learned? Yeah. Maybe let's change you out since I have uh Riza already and let's, let's put Flint back in. Wait, I said put Flint back in. Flint, get in there. Okay, we should be good. Let's go. Really see people using Agatha too often, but I guess Agatha is another good ghost trainer. Well, she is a uniform member, though. All right, so here we go. One defense boost. boost offense. Come on, come on. There we go. The main thing Reuniclus is well known for is large HP. Um, well, that's in the video games though. So it's kind of surprising to see Reuniclus being so offensive in this one. Why is the Gengar attacking the. Oh god. Guys, get it together, please. Hello, ball. Ow. Oh, 
Why do people even use Dust Drop? <laughs> oh god, why another Pokemon that actually takes its own life? Gonna be good. Does Gengar have Dew Eaters? Ow. Should be switching targets soon. We should run as well because uh, Winnicus is gonna do a sync move soon. Uh -oh. Probably shouldn't have chosen Jetta Ball. This is not good. Oh no. Alright, let's boost their defense again, although M, M Boy is gonna die with his own attacks. But this guy is reckless as heck. <laughs> Alright. Sick move on Homika. Somehow we're doing quite okay. Our unity attack is coming together nicely. This is activated. Nice. Okay. Uh, I'm sticking with Lisa again. Because well, there is still that effective bonus. As you can tell, we are having somewhat of a struggle because one of the players isn't that uh, well versed in online battling, I guess. <laughs> Alright, Ridiculous is almost down. To do it, all right. Uh, this guy is just. I don't know, I don't know what this idea of battling. Using random stuff. Okay, so luckily enough, we cleared this challenge. Uh, hopefully, you guys didn't have a strange time like I did, or at least didn't struggle too bad so yeah so as long as you have your proper trainers i guess you would probably do okay so you just need to keep battling out you know and of course uh getting those tickets to exchange them you know from this event exchange corner uh, once again these are important very very important oh apparently now they give the silver ones as well for exchange so that's pretty nice all right guys uh all the best to you guys hopefully you guys didn't struggle too badly like i did and that's a lot of gems i think i have enough now for another 3000 scalp <laughs> so i'm probably gonna do that on my own time uh once again let me guys know how do you guys do for your own personal story completion and of course the co-op play uh, in the comments down below. Leave a like to this video if you enjoyed my horrendous voice acting, or, or rather reading, <laughs> as, 
watch me struggle as I tried to create a story at the same time with the co-op uh, yeah, as you can tell, not everyone uh, can sync well together with you during co-op play <laughs> So yeah guys, until then, I'll see you guys in the next adventure of Pokemon Master Suki Bye!